this rusty glove box here and uh, if you watch Cutworm, uh, I got tagged on his uh, seven question, seven answer deal and man, I told him I'd be sure and, and jump on that, I'd like to give it a shot. Uh, person that I want to tag is uh, Dr. Bruce, Dr. Bruce Bostic. So anyway, Dr. Bruce, I hope you'll take us up on that. I'll be sure and send you a, a PM so you have all the questions for all the answers. Uh, first one is, why do I YouTube? The uh, reason why I YouTube is I used to not take pictures at all of a lot of my projects. I would just start on it, work on it till I got tired of working on it, and you know, go inside, get cleaned up, all that. And uh, as I got older, well, I didn't really have any pictures, you know, or anything of some of the projects. So I started taking uh, snapshots, and uh, that worked pretty good. I have snapshots of several of my projects and all of that. And uh, I had fun, you know, going back through the, the books looking at them. And uh, so anyway, that just kind of migrated into taking video. And uh, I started putting them on YouTube. And I thought because I can access these videos just almost anywhere with the internet, so that would be an easy way for me to store my videos and all that. Uh, long story short on that, uh, the more I kind of put the videos out there and made them public, I started getting people commenting and, and uh, so then, you know, over a period of time kind of met up with some, a good group that we all run with right now and uh, really happy to uh, have them as friends and uh, everybody working together and having a good time. Uh, where did I get my YouTube name? Uh, Rusty Glove Box. Uh, Rusty Glove Box, I like working with metal and uh, a lot of my videos I'm doing something with metal. All right, so just natural, I wanted to use Rusty in there. Uh, then I tried to, to think, all right, what else is it gonna be? Rusty what, you know? And so uh, I thought of several different names and started checking on the internet. Well, somebody's already got those, you know? So it's, it's kind of hard to come up with a new idea on, on, on naming a channel. And so anyway, I started thinking, well, where do you put stuff in a car, you know? Well, you either put it in the trunk, the bed, or in the glove box. So I had done some checking and, you know, trunk had been taken, bed's been, you know, pickup bed's been taken, and I checked glove box. So I thought, rusty glove box. I said, that, that sounds pretty good. So that's kind of how I come up with that name. Uh, how long have you been on YouTube? It's been a little over two years. Uh, I've really enjoyed it. It's been a lot of fun. What camera do you use? I use the Samsung uh, HMX F90. It, it was the one that I bought at the first when I started YouTube. I, I do like it pretty good. It takes good pictures. Uh, I've had it long enough that I'm used to how it functions and everything, so when you're used to a piece of equipment, it's, it's kind of hard to uh, get away from it. So I've been happy with this camera, and uh, I'll probably stay with it till uh, it breaks or I get another one. Uh, do you make your own thumbnails? Um, a lot of times I do. Sometimes I use one of the three. Uh, but once I started figuring out how to make my own thumbnails, I, I just kind of started doing that because it's, it's real easy on how to do it. Uh, do you make your own intros and outros? Um, my intros, sometimes I, I may have something that's kind of like an intro, but I really don't have a, what I'd consider a, a formal intro. Uh, but uh, I do kind of have an outro where I've got my channel sticker. Uh, it, generally, I put it rotating at the, at the last of the video, so I, I guess you would call that an outro. 
Um, would you ever leave YouTube? I, I don't see myself leaving at this time. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun uh, making videos, projects, all of that. It kind of gives me the incentive to go out there and let's do something else so I can make a video and, and all that. And uh, it's just giving me that little extra push to get out there and get out of that recliner and, and get out there in the shop and make some sparks or or work some wrenches, something like that. So anyway, I, you know, unless something really happens, I plan on being on YouTube in a long time. But anyway, that's my seven answers for the seven questions. And uh, Dr. Bruce, I hope you take me up on this challenge. Uh, so I do appreciate y'all watching. This is Rusty Glovebox, and I'm out of here.